What's going on guys? It's Brad the Average Aussie Truck up and back at it again. Today we have, uh, it's supposed to be a bladder changeover, but um, the other driver's actually broken down. So we may be going further. So it may turn into a Tommingley changeover, but we will see. Destination to be advised. <laughs> but yes, yeah, so, um, it's currently the 5th of March. It is 1.35 in the afternoon. We are at the Gatton Pads, or the Gatton, or the old pads, they call them. Uh, we're just about to hook up to our um, road train set. Um, so yeah, we'll, we'll get onto that, and I'll check in with you soon. All right, see you shortly. Okay, so, as I said, guys, here ready to hook up to the road train. As you can see, I've already somewhat backed under it. We, um, so we did a, a ladder changeover yesterday and we're back here to do, well, what's supposed to be another ladder changeover, but as I said earlier, to be advised. But, um, oh, Jesus. Yeah. So, just gonna drop this down a bit so the actual the turntable can get a hold of it. Um, yesterday, hooking up the train yesterday was pretty good. So I got the dolly under first go, but again, I could not get the jaws to hook up. Um, but since then we have actually been told a wee little trick so we might try that there we go Double check, make sure she's locked on awesome oh actually Um, that was actually really good. <laughs> I'm happy with that. So, what I did there was I engaged the air for the trailer. Um, so my truck brakes are still on, but the air brakes in the trailers are released. It's not going to go anywhere. It's not the first time I've done it, and. Honestly, won't be the last. Okay, there we are. But yeah, so she's locked on. Can't make sure I. Make sure I do this first. Oh, and guess what? I can't believe I did it for last night. First time for, you know, first time for everything. <laughs> I actually got the dolly when I dropped them because we had a, a road train go out to Balada and we had a road train come back, right? So when I, when I did the, drop the um, dolly at the Gatton Pads, at the Gatton Road Train Facility. The bloody thing, of course the one time I didn't have it on camera, is the time that I got the dolly to release and do everything first go. I, oh, I was like, you're kidding. And you watch. Now, whenever I record, I guarantee I won't be able to get it again. Please don't have road train. Please tell me I'm wrong. Please tell me I'm wrong. Yes, I'm wrong. Good. That would have been interesting. Yeah, so, um, on what we were saying earlier, apparently 
the fella that I'm supposed to be doing the changeover with, he's actually broken down at Peak Hill in New South Wales. Um, so I gotta double check with them, but by the sounds of it, we will be doing, uh, we will be going as far as Tommingley. But either way, whether we go Coonabarabran or we go all the way into Tommingley, either way, we're not gonna make it back tonight. So it will be um, tonight or tomorrow morning, sorry. Um, usually I would have made it back tomorrow morning, but yeah, we um, definitely weren't gonna make it back. Well, sorry, we're definitely not gonna make it back if, if we go any further past the ladder. Um, only because, you know, the ladder, the ladder's... Oh, so this is how you're gonna start the day. Ah, <laughs> uh, the ladder's already, you know, at the, the limit that we can go within our hours. So, well, go and make it back, sorry. You know, any anything really past the ladder is starting to get into, oh, you could, you could go down to Narrabri and still make it back, but um, you're sort of pushing it, really. What was that noise? Anyway. Tires all look good. We got the air building up. It's doing its thing. That's all hooked up. Lights are all working. It's that. Oh, it's just the air building up in that. Okay. My bags in my truck are dropping. That's not good. And general shuts down. What do you expect, mate? You take so bloody long to get things done. I would too. But yeah, I'd say we we would have a um a train going out, train coming back, so. We shall see, we shall see. But yeah, I'm gonna go, um, I'm gonna go and get to Gundawindi and give them a call from there, see what they want us to do. So, anyway guys, I'm gonna let you go, I'll check in with you soon, eh? just received word from the other driver he's actually got going so Tommy Lee probably won't be our stop now probably uh, we're, we're gonna work it out a little bit further down the road but we're looking at either Kernavarabran or Narrabri so definitely won't be the Pelliga <laughs> but no no um, yeah, we'll either be stopping at Kunabarabran or we'll be going through to um, uh, sorry, we'll, we'll be either stopping at Narrabri or we'll be going through to Kunabarabran. So, yeah, either way, we'll find out shortly. I say shortly, it'll be shortly for you guys. It'll be a couple of hours down the road for me. But yeah, either way, we'll find out. 
and I will um, I'll inform you what I know. But I'm just going through Mill Merrin right now, which it is a nice little town here. I I can't wait to. S I, I would love to be able to go to their um, camp oven festival, which. I know, old Ronnie on the, the bonnet. You talking about me, yes, mate? I'm talking about you. Don't badmouth me, <laughs> mate. I know where you sleep, eh? No, nothing bad. Calm down. This is me calm, mate. Jesus, coming from anyway, old princess over here uh, gets upset about gloves. Oh, you cheeky bugger. Yeah, good on ya. Truth hurts, don't it, mate? <laughs> anyway, so yeah, well, um... Just see how it goes, and yeah, sorry, um, I, w I wouldn't mind going to that camp oven festival, checking that out. Apparently, it is, um, you know, top notch. It's really good, but yeah, I'm sure when we, if we if we are working and we end up coming out here, I'm sure I'll smell it when we come through. <laughs> God, I hope the original plan is filming stable. I feel sick. Yeah, righto, Ronnie. Sorry, guys. Had a malfunction with the mount here. Excuses, excuses. Of a bladder changeover. Turn and burn back to Brizzy. Gonna take the lead and dolly back to the yard tonight. Tomorrow morning, whenever we get back, I don't know. Probably be tomorrow morning early. Then we'll have our break. And by the sounds of it, we'll be doing dog runs tomorrow. Well, my bring is along for that. That'll be something different. A little bit repetitive and boring, but something different. Add to this. But, yeah. Today's Tuesday. That'll be Wednesday afternoon. I don't know what happens for the rest of the week yet. Maybe do another changeover and then that'll be us, but ideally that'll be good. Get a full week then. But yeah, we'll just, uh, time will tell, we'll wait and see. When I know, you guys will know. <laughs> I'm sure we'll find out tomorrow sometime what, what the goal is, but yeah. It's going to be a fun and exciting day tomorrow. <laughs> ah, like I said, it, at least it's something. A little bit more work, you know. Keep us busy. Which is always good. But yeah, we'll, we'll get down here, do this changeover. I think I'll pull up, have a bite to eat, Danny. And then, um, Get back on the road, get back to Brizzy. <laughs> All right, guys. <laughs> so, we've made it to Tukey Creek Rest Area. We've gone to unhook, only to realize I had a missed phone call while I was unhooking. And we managed to get bugs in the truck. Lovely. Welcome to my uh, life, sucker. Yeah, so, 
I jumped back up, I rang the number, there's the Brisbane office telling me to keep going because the driver has broken down again, he's blown a steer tyre um, in the middle of the pillager. Poor oh, bugger. <laughs> that, that is um, not a place you want to blow a tyre, especially when it looks like this outside. <laughs> oh, I feel for him. I really do. That sucks. But anyway, so we'll keep going. We'll get down to Narrabri. Uh, we'll unhook and then we'll park up somewhere. And then turn around and burn it back to Brizzy in the morning. So, yeah, I don't think our dog runs will be happening now. <laughs> hey, never say never. You never know. <laughs> anyway, guys, we'll check in with you once we pull up in Narrabri. Princess? Ah, uh, shouldn't be that bad. I get in, get out, see later. No mucking about. But yeah, we'll um, check in with you soon, guys. Hmm. Chicken and cranberry with creamy potato bake for dinner. You mean cranberry? Should be good. Elegant. <laughs> All right, so we went down, we got, met old mate just down the road here, um, swap, dropped my trailers, picked these ones up, it's a A-double, full of milk, um, yeah, we'll grab that, take it back to Brizzy tomorrow, um, we're currently at the uh, shell at Narrabri gonna park up here for the night and get up early in the morning head back to Brisbane so yeah that should should be good I'm aiming to leave here about seven o'clock Queensland time so that should get us back I think with dropping that down there and all that that should get us back there about Five, maybe six o'clock um, if there's no hold-ups and if I can get the, the dolly to work properly for me uh, I say get the dolly to work properly for me but I, I really mean actually work the dolly properly <laughs> but yeah we'll um, do that and then um, see what the rest of the week holds because now we won't be doing the dog runs uh, we won't be back in time unless they get us to do our dog run tomorrow, which wouldn't be so bad. Drop the lead and dolly and then come back for the, the second trailer. It'll get us some more some more Ks and some more more time, which would be good. Um, but yeah, I, I I'm sort of hoping we get the weekend at home again. I had last weekend off at home and I ended up going up to my parents place and that was good I actually my my son is starting to get to that point now where his personality's coming out so I, I really got to see his little personality come out which was good that's so funny he's um seven months old so he's he's so advanced it's not funny he's starting to crawl and He's actually starting to stand and do all that sort of stuff and he's so strong. But yeah, it's pretty amazing to see. So yeah, but anyway guys, I'm gonna um, 
have me dinner and then I'm off to bed. So I'll catch catches in the morning. All right, see you soon. Good morning, guys. Okay, we're good to go. <laughs> so we're gonna make the trip back to uh, Brizzy. We're still currently at Narrabri. Because you know the truck's yes. gonna go somewhere. I know, always say it, Ron. Oh my God. You're so grumpy of a morning, mate, Jesus. Haven't had my coffee yet. Anyway, yeah, so we're gonna go back to Brizzy today. I have to drop the dolly, uh, sorry, the rear trailer at Gatton. Oh, excuse me. And then we'll um, take the rest into Booth Yard. I don't know if we'll do our dog run. We'll find out later, but yeah. Anyway, we'll get back on the road. We'll check in with you soon. Made it to the pads. We're gonna drop this. Oh, that's all right. So last night, oh, as you can see, old mate had to change a tire. That's the uh, tire that's left. I just realised it doesn't look real good. Well, duh. What did you um, expect? A brand new tire? Pelican. What was I saying? Can't remember what I was saying. Yeah, so we'll drop these tra these trailers off here. I've uh, been informed that we are actually going to turn and burn. Ah, I just received a message. I'm not sure my uh, trailer numbers or anything yet, but I just received a message saying what. Uh, Sorry, <laughs> I can't think. I just received the message with the trailer numbers that I'm gonna be taking out again. But yeah, from what I understand, we're gonna turn and burn, head back to the ladder and do another changeover. Only difference is this time, we will um, pretty much be staying out there tonight because there's no way no way in the world we're going to have enough hours to um, to get out there and back. Okay. So yeah, we'll. Um, we're going to. <laughs> I nearly caught myself out. Yeah, so um, we're gonna go out there, uh, go back to Brizzy, pick up this set of trailers, hopefully it's only a double, and then we're going to um, turn and burn back to Ballada. So, or Tukey Creek, sorry. 
Uh, we'll probably we'll spend the night at either Tukey Creek or if we've got time we'll try to get back to Gundawindi. I don't see that happening but you never know. Surprised old Ronnie's been very quiet. I'm just watching. Yeah. Ten bucks says you screwed up as usual though. Ten bucks says I don't. How many times have we been through this mate? See, told ya. Shut up. Shut up. I don't need to say anything mate, you do it yourself. You make it too easy for me. Shut up. Smart ass freaking bird. That's me buddy. <laughs> what have I done wrong here? Let's see, turn the wrong tap. Maybe? Turn the wrong bloody tap again. I may not be a smart bird, but at least I know how to turn taps properly. Jesus. Ah, <laughs> oh, one of these days. Of course, the one that I don't record, I get first bloody time. Sure, sure. Keep telling yourself that. And when I do record, you show everyone how much of a bloody pelican you are, mate. Jesus. At least you got it this time. See what I mean? <laughs> oh, Jesus. I really don't think he can help you, mate. I'm sorry to tell you. God. Yep, he can't you either. Don't even. Calm down, princess. Just because you can't remember which bloody tap to turn off in the first place. I'm glad I didn't bet money with you. Yeah, well, I wouldn't be sitting here if I bloody took money from you every time. <laughs> bloody smart ass. Anyway, all right, guys. <laughs> oh, honestly, you just gotta laugh. At you? Yes, I do, all the time. All right, let's have a look. Anyway, guys. With that, I'm going to end the video here. Thank you very much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, don't forget to like. And if you haven't already, please consider subscribing. And as always, if you didn't like the video, leave a comment down below. Let me know what I could do better. Always looking to do things better, make it better. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching. We'll catch us on the next one. Hooroo. Here's the yarn, everyone. Ronnie the duck on the front of the truck, back at it again to say thank you to the legends of the week. And this week, we are saying thank you to Ken Blackwood. Once again, thank you very much, my for your support. Really appreciate it. All right, guys. We'll catch us on the next one. Hooray.